Well, how's it going, y'all? Uh, hope everybody had a Merry Christmas. I know I did. It was uh, pretty good. I got a uh, got some PJs, a bag of T-shirts. Uh, what else? That's pretty much it that people got me. Mainly my mom. But uh, I bought myself a PS3. Yes, a PS3, and uh, I bought Uncharted 2, and it's pretty damn good. The graphics and everything on, on the PS3, are, in my opinion, are a little bit better than the 360. Especially in Uncharted 2, because it's like you're in an actual movie, but uh, it's pretty sweet. I've only played about an hour of it, and then uh, I watched a movie and went to bed because it was real late. And I uh, played some Left 4 Dead 2 the same night with uh, some friends of mine. Anyway, let's uh, let's get back to the game here. Uh, got got in the tank and uh, went up the hill. I find that's the best place to go in the tank because nobody suspects it, and you kind of sneak in from behind them and destroy them like I did that guy. And uh, I I just recently switched to the MG42. I believe that's what I'm using on this map. Uh, it's very hard to use it because it's big and bulky and you can hardly move with it. I'm about like a fat chick. But uh, the fire rate on it's pretty good, but the clip is just. As soon as you hold the trigger button down, it basically just depletes itself automatically. You have to keep reloading, but the reload time is so terrible. It's so slow. But, uh,. It's pretty good from a, a long range standpoint. You know, if you just sit back in the building, you know, pick them off as they run by, or if you slowly move building to building, stay in cover and, and pick them off, or, uh, or uh, mount it on a window. But uh, I hardly ever mount it on a window. Uh, this guy shoots me with a rocket launcher. I'm a little worried here. I don't know why that shot didn't kill him, so I switched to the. Uh, Gun on top and kill him before he can shoot another rocket at me. And uh, I get artillery and I wanna I wanna run back out of the way just so I don't get killed in the tank with one more kill for dogs or two more kills, excuse me. And uh, sit here and wait. And I thought there's gonna be people right there, but I, I guess not. So. Uh, so yep, Christmas Day, getting ready to head out as soon as I get done making this video and go to a family dinner and hang out, watch a little bit of football if there's any on. Uh, kind of hungry actually, I've been, been eating chocolates all morning and it's, it's ruining my diet. Not that I really have one, but if you eat too much sweets all morning like I do, man, your stomach starts to hurt. I'm gonna put these chocolates up. I don't want any more to do with that right now. I only need one more kill for dogs, so I'm actually, you know, sitting here for a minute, kind of two second camping. Uh, oh, yeah, I really rape them right here. Kill that guy, and some other guy turns around and lays down. But uh, he's out in the middle of the open, and I can just get behind the corner of that building and throw an aid and kill him when he runs around. Uh, yeah, you see how the gun, you really have to burst it like you do with the RPD and COD 4 in order for it to be accurate. Now, if you're in close range, by all means, go full auto, but make sure you uh, aim well or your clip will be gone before you know it. I almost killed that guy on the tank. I wish I did, because I would have went and grabbed it. See that bursting? It's got pretty good range if you burst it like that. And it doesn't take that many bullets to kill him. 15 kill streak. Oh yeah, 15 kill streak. Dogs keep tearing him up, same time I am with a gun. Been hearing a lot of complaints from everybody and a lot of trash talking about how everybody can beat me. Uh, 
I really don't give a damn if you can beat me. I mean, who cares? I mean, I, I do this as a hobby, and it's fun for me to just sit here and play and record games, put them up, because some of them are pretty good. Get that guy with a headshot. That was pretty sweet. I get caught on those bandoliers right there. I believe that's what they're called. They're they're so. I mean, you get caught on them so easy. And it can really screw you up if you're trying to get back behind that wall. Somebody's shooting at you and you get caught on the damn thing and somebody kills you. Keep an eye on that bell tower. Uh, a lot of snipers like to get up there. A lot of times it's a real easy kill because, I mean, they have a large area to cover and all you have to do is look at their little small area up there and kill them. Like right here, I get stuck on a bandolier off subject there but it's an easy kill if you're up in the bell tower so like you need one more kill just look up there and you might get lucky and get a kill and get dogs this guy finally kills me in his mp40 i didn't want to watch the kill cam i was too busy trying to hurry up and get more kills I spawn behind him he about kills me but i kill him running along the wall here they just keep coming out at me I mean it's stupid man you just run out in the middle of the open against everybody it's, it's stupid wow the game's almost over this game went by pretty quick Somebody called in their dogs, which really screwed me up because I could have had two more kills right there. But I got a, got some assists off of it. And there's a guy in the bell tower. And I get an assist right here, I believe. Yep. Dogs went up there and got him. It's probably in last stand. But anyway, uh, that's the video. 24, 1 and 1. Uh, pretty good. Hope you guys had a good Christmas, and I will see you on the flip side.